Oh, hello there, it's Angus here, um, got a wee product review. Gonna make this nice and quick. This is for a product called Skinners, which are basically super duper socks. Um, they have antibacterial yarns, or are they shoes? And they have toe protection. Um, so that is the box, and this is what they look like. So let me give you this. So they have this, they are basically just a sock. Um, and I haven't washed these since I got these in February and it's now May. They, you have to really sniff to, to get them. I don't know what they would be like after machine wash. Sometimes that antibacterial stuff wears off after that. I just don't know. They do, as you can see, pick up all the hairs from your carpet, which is probably one of the things I just like most about them. And um, not that I really care about stuff like that at all. Um, they are super, flexible there's absolutely no effort in that they are just a sock with this rubbery knobbly kind of grippy rubber type um grip kind of painted onto them um and these knobbles actually don't come off i thought after walking a little bit all these little knobbly bits would come off but they're really on there um you get a bit of toe protection you get a bit of heel protection they fit Absolutely, I am sitting on the floor so I can bring my foot up to show you. So they slide on, super easy, and here is my foot in them. So they fit perfectly, heel protection up around the toe. They are super comfy on and they're super light. So if you like minimalist shoes, you will absolutely love these. So basically this is where my review gets really favorable for them. I really like them, I absolutely love them. Nice and snug fit. No looseness when they're on. They're absolutely wicked on. And they're really great on. The only running I've done on these is actually on a curved treadmill. And they were actually really fun and light. I like minimalist shoes for running in because I'm a very forward striker because my ankle locks at 90 degrees. So I land very on my toe and hardly ever make contact with the heel. So minimalist shoes really suit my running style, which isn't perfect running style. But... As a bit of a heavier guy, um, I don't get any knee injuries or lower back injuries from running. Um, occasionally get tight calves that I have to release. But these are these are super great. I'm actually looking forward. Um, the weather's better here in Scotland just now, so we I am gonna go test these on a bit of a, a bit of a run on various ground on these. The one thing I wouldn't want to do is step in dog poo with these, although they are machine washable, so. Um, rather than just if you step in dog poo and you have to pour water on your trainers, not super great. But these are machine washable. Um, they're super lightweight. If you like minimal shoes, you're gonna love these. The biggest complaint I have with these is the price. They're 40 euros and they are just a sock. You can get world-class socks, not these, but you know, like what's the most expensive sock? A four pack for a tenner? And these are 40 euros. Although, in their defense, they're probably the greatest minimalist shoe ever created. And they're 40 dollars. 40 euros, sorry. Dollars, pounds. Um, 40 euros. Where a pair of Vivo Barefits, the Modus, are like 120. And I prefer these to the to the Modus. Um, I prefer these to most all minimalist shoes, apart from the trail running. Uh, the trail running. New Balance Minimus, um, I can't remember what they're called, MT10 or something. Um, they're my absolute favorite barefoot shoes. They're kind of robust and they're, they're nice, but they do have a bit of cushioning where this has zero cushioning. This is all foot. This is all you. So if you are into barefoot running, these are great. If you're not into barefoot running, what these are really great for is to use as a slipper in your house because these will help strengthen your feet. So as a training aid, these would be super awesome to pick up and get. Um, I've done a few workouts in the gym with these um, and they're fine. You get really good connection into the floor. I don't know about super heavy deadlifts, what they're like, but that toe protection seems to, my foot doesn't really slip in them. It really fits snug on your foot, which is great. Um, I wonder if I was really splaying out on a deadlift, what they would be like. But I wouldn't really push them. They're great for just moving around and getting some work done and you're kind of walking around. You do feel a bit vulnerable if you drop something on your toe, but even a normal pair of trainers don't actually give you any protection. So um, that's my review for them. 
Here's a wee boxy. Um, yep, I like them. I give them top top marks, top thumbs up. Um, you can pick them up at www.skinners.cc or check out Skinners on Facebook and you can kind of interact and see what they're saying about their own product. Um, I like them, I give them top marks, just think they're a little bit expensive um, for what, what they are. And if they were, say 20 euros, I probably would have bought two pairs um, rather than one pair for $40. I just think the markup on these, because I don't think these are that expensive to produce, even though it's nice quality and I have really no complaints with them. I just think it's at the upper end of the market, but they're still less than half the price of a pair of so-called minimalist shoes when these are as minimalist as you are going to get. Anyway, review over.